This is a new song I wrote about a special woman who I let slip away. We were uh, touring down in uh, Nashville back in 2014, me and the boys. Uh, Gus wasn't with us yet, but everybody else was the same. And uh, I saw this beautiful woman, most beautiful woman I ever saw, and uh, I just couldn't get myself to say nothing. And I let her slip away right there like a poof of smoke, and I, I was so low that I didn't say nothing. I was so low. I was kicking myself for months. But the boys, you know, they told me to buck up. Well, a couple of years go by and now we're we're doing the rhyming. We're back in Nashville doing the rhyming auditorium, two sold out shows because our song Whiskey Nichols has started to get some radio play and things were going pretty well. Well, we had two good shows. Shout out to Jimmy Miller who runs the rhyming. He does a great job down there bringing in good acts. Well, we're having some jacks getting slippery, uh, and who do I see go on that stage? It was that same woman, I swear to you. I was like, y'all, that's her. They were like, who? I was like, that's her. She starts singing my song. She starts singing Whiskey Nickel. I was like, if I can't say hi to her now, I don't deserve no love. You know, I might as well move to Alaska and live in a cabin, hunt bear for a living. So I take one more shot of Jack for liquid courage, and I march on down there. I'm confident now. People saying, hey, Lester, good show. Hey, Lester, can we get a photograph? Hey, Lester. And I didn't hear a word. I'm like making a beeline for this beautiful woman. And I, I stand there. I wait for her to finish politely. And I, I, I put a little $20 bill in the tip jar, make sure she sees it's a 20. And I said, that's a beautiful voice you got there, Missy. And she said, that's what my mama always told me. And I said, uh, I like that song. What is that song? And she goes, uh, that's my song. I wrote that a, a few months ago. It's called Freight Train Whiskey. And I said, what do you mean that's your song? Well, this bouncer comes up. He's seven feet tall if I'm an inch. I mean, he's an ox if I'm a mouse. He goes, hey, Susie Lou, this guy bothering you? And she nodded at him. I was like, God damn. I'm like, she's playing my songs. I'm Lester Nichols. That's Whiskey Nichols. Everybody's staring at me now. And he puts his hand on me, starts guiding me away from the stage. And I mean, he's got tree trunk arms. He's moving me, y'all. And then I hear her voice, just like Caramel, come over the microphone. She goes, Lester, I know who you is. I was just playing a prank on you. Me and T-Bone went in on it. And we got you good, didn't we? And I said, well, God damn. And she goes, hey, you only tipped me $20 after you sell out two shows at the Ryman. And I said, I need to marry this woman. And I, I got down on my knee right then and there, and I proposed, y'all. And she said yes, and the whole bar went nuts. And we sang a duet, and it was the best night of my life, y'all. I was happier than a dead pig in sunshine. She's back home pregnant with our firstborn, Lester Jr. Thank you. Thank you. I'm blessed. I'm very blessed. I'm so lucky to have Susie Lou, and this song's about her. It's called She Got Me Good. <laughs> Shit, we're out of tune. Can you give me the Gibson? The Gibson. There's only one Gibson back there. Now, you know what? We're just going to play it. I made you wait long enough. You know what they say? You can tune all day, play yourself a good song, or you can tune once, play yourself a country song. All right. She got me good. She got me good. She got me good. I knew she would. I knew she would, I knew she would She got me good, but I got hurt too Thank y'all, thank you, it's a short one, just like Susie Lou, she's 5'2 Alright, this next one's a new one about my firstborn, Lester Jr. He's uh, three months